Rubber vacuums are not just about sucking up dust anymore. At IFA Berlin 2025, we saw robots that can climb stairs, squeeze on the couches, swap their own mop pads, even let you add fragrance to your clean. Today, I'll break down what Smurfa and Ufa revealed, share real specs, and help you see what those features actually mean for your home. And first up, Mova. Their new line is packed with features, but one standout is the V50 Ultra Complete, and here is what I found out. It uses a 24,000 Pascal suction power, which is very high compared to many robot vacuums. The battery is a 6,400 mAh lithium ion pack, and it features the trouble wave, drop brush, and triple angle technology to reduce the likelihood of brushes getting clogged with air. For mopping, dual spinning pads, one pad can extend for edge coverage, and it applies pressure when mopping, which helps you with tougher stains. Mop pads also lift 7.5 mm when moving onto carpet, so carpets don't get wet. The dock is really advanced. It empties the dustbin into a 3.2 liters disposable bag, claiming up to 100 days of debris, depending on how dirty your home is. It also has a water management, washing pads, spray nozzles, and a system to dry the mop pads called the Omini Dry so they don't stay damp and smell. It includes a flexi sensor system, sensors that retract to fit on the low furniture, then raise when needed for better navigation. Now, here's what we know about the Hufi Omni S2 with its tech carrying partner called the Mass Walker. The Omni S2 has 30,000 Pascal suction power. This is very strong, able to tackle carpets even take ones. It uses something called Hydrojet 2.0 for mopping, a roller mop that spins fast, applies about 15 newtons or approximately 3.3 pounds of downward force and can extend up to 15 millimeters to help clean along walls and baseboards. For obstacle detection, a smart AI system called CleanMind AI that has a 3D time of flight sensor, RGB camera, LED lighting and can recognize over 200 types of obstacles, socks, cables, smart toys, etc. It can cross obstacles of 4.2 cm or 1.65 inches high. And also, the mop can lift to avoid carpet. It has a complete dock station called the Uniclean Station that also empties the dustbin, washes and dry mop pads, refuse, cleans water tanks, etc. The Mass Walker platform is very interesting. It's not part of the robot itself, but it's an accessory. It's like a stair carrier for the Omni S2. It has tracks and extendable arms, and is intended to move the Omni S2 up and down straight, hell-shaped and U-shaped staircases. So for a multi-floor, instead of carrying the robot yourself, the Mass Walker does it for you. And it is later for Spring 2026, although pricing is not yet clear. Also, the Omni S2 is expected to launch in Europe around late October 2025 for about £1,600. In the US market, it should be around early 2026. Putting this together, here is how things stack up. And this is what the specs actually mean for you. Suction and carpet cleaning, both are very strong. Mova's 24,000 Pascal and Yuffie's 30,000 Pascal are up there with top tier robot vacuum cleaners. If you have thick carpets or pets, these numbers actually matter. Mopping and floor protection. Mova's mop pads lift 10.5 mm so carpets can stay dry. Yuffie's mop can lift too and it's a system called automatic mop cleaning and drying. That means less manner wiping and less chance of mold. Under furniture and low clearance. Mova's flexi right sensor system that retracts makes it easier to get under sofas. Ufi doesn't have that lower under furniture by itself. Multi floor support. Here's the difference Mova's U6.0 claims to climb stairs on its own. Ufi's approach is via the Mats Walker accessory. The robot docks into a walker, which lifts or carries it upstairs and down. Depending on your stair type, that might matter. Maintenance convenience. Both have robust base stations. Mova's dock has water tanks. Dual cleaning solution, one for general, one for pet odor, spray to wash mop pads, drying, etc. UFI's Uniclean station also empties, washes, dries, and refuel tanks, so less ants. Extras and comfort features. UFI added the built in fragrance capsule system to add scents during cleaning, which is nice if you care about your home smelling fresh. What's really exciting is seeing how robot vacuum cleaners have been thought of as the old home solutions, not just gadgets. They are getting smarter about moving between floors or stairs, staying clean themselves, drying, mops, auto-washing, dealing with obstacles without human help, and protecting carpets, 
and being gentle where needed. And even small touches like letting you choose scent, those show these things are no longer just about will it vacuum, but how will living with it feel every day. So if you are choosing, ask yourself, do you want one robot that can climb stairs itself? If you can get the mobile zoot, or are you okay with the stair carrier accessory like U5's mass walker? Do you care more about mop cleanliness and drying, or about eye suction and carpet performance? If you like the deeper dive into IFA 2025 robot vacuums, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe for more breakdowns, and hit me up in the comments which feature would make your life easier. Stair climbing, mop drying, strong suction, smelt capsules, I'd love to know.